I don't expect a president of a country to say, Wiki Blacks Buhari again. Hello, my wonderful people. We all are aware that uh, Nusom Wiki himself and Buhari, uh, I mean, he doesn't take it easy with the guy at all. I mean, Buhari is that person who knows, you know, that Wiki is one of those who would tell him as it is. And what Buhari has been trying to do recently any voice who is a serious critic at him, he tries to buy them over, just like FFK, you know, has been bought over. And you can see that the silence, he can no longer speak. The sound of his voice has been swallowed up. FFK is not is now as still as a mouse, you see, he can no longer speak, you see. So these are some of the things happening. These are some of the things ongoing. FFK can no longer speak. And as we speak now, we can see that, um, you know, Wiki was very disappointed at some things Buhari has done recently. And he's saying, ah, I did not expect this from you. You should have done more. I mean, we expected much more better from you, you know, rather than this very, you know, this attitude and this thing that you have done is very sad. It's not what we expected from you in any way form or kind uh please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like or share subscribe let's get all the details i don't expect a president of a country to say wiki blast buhari again the river state governor newsom wiki has identified bad governance as a major cause of insecurity in the country noting that all must be done to reverse the trend Speaking in Abuja on Wednesday during a lecture he delivered at the National Institute for Security Students, NISS, Wiki recalled that President Muhammadu Buhari once openly declared that those who voted for him will get more benefit from his government than those who didn't. He noted that such statements are not expected from a country's leaders a leader who is supposed to be the president at its as it gives some people a certain feeling of marginalization and makes them lose interest in the government, which is why the call for separation has been loudest. The governor added for true development to take place, every stakeholder must carry along. The government must be responsible and must carry everyone along. We can say now, take for example, with all due respect, Mr. President, said 90%, sometimes sometimes some percent of whatever we go on, only those who voted for him and alone will create, this alone will create crisis. The words of the president is very shocking. It has, he said it six years ago, but I had to bring it up in this meeting. That is not part of good governance. I don't expect a president of a country to say, I will only remember those who voted for me. You are indeed not a democratic president. And that is what we are experiencing. The River State Governor spoke on the top governance, security and sustainable development in Africa. Challenges the prospect and River State in a, as a metropolitan city. The lecture was for the participants of the Executive Intelligence Management course who are conducting their studies at the NISS. Wiki argued that the administration of President Muhammad Buhari has been, has been known to give one, SS, one excuse or another in the areas that they have failed, citing that this government is not responsible at all. No meaningful development since he took over in 2015. He added that the federal government and all stakeholders must find a way to bring all aggrieved person to the table and discuss the grievances towards finding a workable solution rather than sectionizing some people. He submitted that only when the government is seen as working with everyone and not with a particular set can we truly as a country work together and say there is unity, oneness and fairness. Other than that, the sense of injustice keep plaguing us in the face. So this is what Wiki said at a lecture he was previewed to give, um, to give, a, 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 you know, to speak to the people with regards to what is currently going on. And, it's, and he was really disappointed, you see. He said, I'm seriously disappointed by, you know, by the disposition of this administration. I am, I'm, I'm seriously disappointed. 
I do not expect many of the things I am hearing from the so-called number one person of the country. You know, this man spoke and said he will only be president to those who voted him. Who does that? Who really does that? Sadly, President Muhammad Buhari is one of such people who does that and is not even, uh, is not apologetic about it. He says it, I mean, without any form of, you know, records of, you know, uh, is not, is not afraid to even say it. You know, he said it almost six years ago, and you can see it. Those that comes to join APC, you see how they silence them with money. You know, we're talking about uh, selling of birthright. You know, it's it's every day ongoing. The selling of birthright is every day ongoing. The love for money, how people can, you know, do whatever they are doing and pretend to all. You know, how people, you know, are selling off what belongs to everybody because they were given a few millions of dollars or whatever amount they were given. You see, everybody's watching and the whole world is seeing how Nigerian government is playing out our politics. Sadly, those that should speak, everybody is silent. And so these are part of the issues and trouble facing the country today. We all have to rise up to the occasion and say no to the extinct oppression facing us and staring us in the face. Nigeria has come to that point where we do not have people who truly are speaking in terms of, you know, truth, justice, and most people are just speaking, you know, you know, in terms of uh, what they will get. You see, this, has, this is part of why Nigeria is what it is today. This is why Nigeria is what it is today. And it is a hard call for everybody, you know, to understand that we have a duty here. You know, this is Wike telling Buhari. And you know, Wike is that person. I wish most governors are as fearless as Wike and, uh, and uh, uh, you know, uh, the governor of uh, uh, Benue State, who will say it as it is and tell Buhari to his face, you are doing the wrong thing and it is wrong. Let's look for a way forward. Let's discuss. Those who are supporting Buhari, those who stand by him, those who are, you know, uh, beside him are the ones who are telling him you are doing well. Don't answer them. They are all, uh, they are all, uh, they don't have what to say. This, um, and you, you're listening to them. You've forgotten that at the end of the day, none of their names will be mentioned. Your name will be mentioned, you know. And, you know, they, they think that yeah, you, you can never, you can never in Nigeria, they think that they can never get consequences for their action. It's a lie. A day is coming. Every one of them will be in jail. Watch it. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Subscribe if this is your first time. God bless you. Bye for now.